invite Mrs. Patricia Sutherland, who is the Executive Director of Special Projects in the JMMB Group, to bring greetings. Um, Pat, earlier I said you were the daughter of Joan Duncan. I was suitably corrected. Joan Duncan and Dr. D.K. Duncan. <laughs> and I also have an apology for you because we made an error in the program. <laughs> but we want to thank you for your graciousness and the generosity and support of the JMMB group. Please welcome Patricia. Well, thank you very much, Dr. Don. Um, yes. You know, it's a wonderful thing. It doesn't matter what we are called. It really just matters who we are. And, um, so, you know, today it's, it's my pleasure because the theme for today's lecture is really one that um, I would have to say it could also be the Joan Duncan lecture series. Yeah. Rebel woman, rebel women, engendering transformation. We grew up with a rebel woman. And I know I'm supposed to be talking on behalf of Jim and B. <laughs> but um, it resulted in a Jim and B. But it resulted in a Jim and B because of a rebel woman. A rebel woman who, and you know, I looked at just now, because I have to confess I don't know much about Lucille Mayer. So just now, briefly, I looked at a paragraph about what, why it is that we are honoring Lucille Mayer with this lecture series. And it's really about her contribution to thought. She was a rebel because of her thought and how she contributed to the development of thought as a lecturer, as an author, and also as a proponent of gender rights and gender issues. And uh, I thought to myself, that's the common thread with my mother. And that's the common thread that she has created in a company such as GMMB that would allow people to be rebels in thought. And that's really where it all begins, because who we are is a result of our thoughts. And uh, being a rebel is usually, in most cases, thought of as a bad thing or thought of, but it's really the basis for change. It's the basis for change, and it's the basis for growth, and it's the basis for difference. And so today, I am honored to stand here on behalf of GMMB. You have to remember it's Gem and B, right? Marketing. Imani, are you here? Marketing, the Gem and B. Felicity, I'm doing my job, Gem and B. <laughs> because in Mommy's Thoughts, she chose to put out there that it is possible to base a company, to be a corporate entity based on love. And that was her most rebellious thought. That love is the basis for all things. Right? And having been 19 years now as a company, we can proudly say love pays. It pays. It pays in hard currency. It pays in relationships. It pays in respect. It pays in development, it pays in growth as an individual. And uh, I believe that if you speak to all persons who have had interactions with GMMB, they can say directly how it paid for their life. Whether it paid in the return on their investment, whether it paid in their interaction that they had with an individual at GMMB, whether it paid in painful growth for understanding what they need to do for their own development, it pays. And so, today, as this love has now brought another mother into my life, which makes me even more proud to be here, Mrs. Beverly Anderson Duncan. Um, 
it and how we have been able to embrace each other as family, how mommy was able to embrace Beverly as family, how she was able to be a part of that growth process, that rebellious thought of love and developing what we have at GMMB, we call our vision of love, that we use as our basis for interacting with each other, that we use to guide our principles in our decision making, in our um, discourse, in our discussions. Beverly was a part of writing that. And that, so I have been blessed. And I suspect that if we all check our lives, we have been blessed with that rebellious woman who has been able to be a rebellion, has had that rebellion of thought that has touched our lives, that has changed our lives, that has impacted our lives. But we have not yet recognized it. And so today I honor also Beverly Anderson Duncan and I'm very happy and very proud to be here to sit and witness this lecture and so please enjoy a la GMMB <laughs> this lecture by Beverly Anderson Duncan in honor of Lucille Mayer. Thank you.